It is Mother's Day weekend, and while many spent time celebrating mom, some also talked about the Supreme Court's draft opinion that would overturn Roe v. Wade, which guaranteed women their right to abortion would be federally protected. KITV4's Jefferson Tyler found out what mothers have to say about reproductive rights. As protesters hit the street in New York, Wisconsin, Missouri, and other places on this Mother's Day, the politics of abortion is rising up. I was up in D.C. when the um, announcement about the decision came out. I, I was overwhelmed with anger, with sadness, frustration. I actually found myself at the middle of the night, at midnight, walking to the Supreme Court and joining hundreds of others right there at the steps of the Supreme Court to make sure our voices were heard. I'm not going to let bunch of extreme Supreme Court justices or extreme right-wing politicians take away the rights of a hundred million American women. Who should make this decision? Should it be a woman and her doctor or a politician? I would prefer the rape and incest exceptions to be in there. And even though we have the trigger law, I expect those exceptions to be a significant part of the debate. The recent revelation of the Supreme Court considering overturning Roe versus Wade is also lingering in minds of those enjoying Mother's Day on Hawaii beaches. I do worry about it because I don't want them to have to go to another state if they're not ready to have a child or if something were to happen. It's not easy being a mom, and this is the day where all the hard work pays off. Mother's Day to me is a celebration of bringing life into the world. Um, being a mom is something that's a 24-7 job. You know, you're cooking, you're cleaning, you're sending the kids to school, you're making, you're taking care of them when you're sick. Spending more time with her, letting her know how grateful I am for her everyday duties as a mom, even though she doesn't have to. Raven Rosa Lasco is happy to be spending the day with her mom. As for the topic of abortion rights. When I know I'm ready to have a child and bring a child into this world, I will know. But if it happens, I guess it happens, but at the end of the day, it's still my choice. We give them the skills to do what they need to do, and if they follow it, it's good. If they're not, you just got to support them. Jefferson Tyler, KITV4, Island News.